Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live from Madrid here on EA TV. And welcome to the Rosas section of the Spanish capital. We're here at the Metropolitano. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's Spain against Italy. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Here's the lineup for Spain. Dani Olmo plays with Ferran Torres out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the Italy starting 11. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Leonardo Bonucci plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And so the battle commences. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, you don't really want to be picking up a caution so early in the game, Stuart. Well, he's going to be under pressure now. That was a reckless challenge. He didn't need to make it at all. The high press was very much on. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Must be! Well, decent save there. <laughs> it's a short one. They can keep possession of it now. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Jorginho, a very effective challenge put in. This attack looks highly promising. He takes aim. Pretty simple for the keeper.
Ciro Immobile. Oh, big chance! Well, just went a bit too early, offside. Teammates available. Immobile. Can they notch in front? Immobile finishing perfectly. Finishers are totally single-minded, and he fell in that category just then. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Immobile takes the shot and a body in the way Marco Asensio now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Jorginho is in with a chance. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. for the short corner and with that the attack fizzles out Pedri can they do something positive on the counter attack well they seem to be onto something positive but it faded away able to skip past his man it's got to be Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, they survived the attack. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Well, on the back of that breathtaking piece of goalkeeping, can they keep the ball and create? Now, can they create something? Well, to not. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee, and maybe they'll be able to level this up. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty yes, yellow card no. Chance to equalise here. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Well, let's look at this again, and it's always a risky penalty. When it comes off, it looks great. If it's saved, you look foolish. On this occasion, it's a great penalty. So back on the way. One goal apiece here. Thinking there. Jordi Alba. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Torres. 
what was going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And so it is. The first half has come to an end here in the Spanish capital. Well, a lot to like about Chiro Immobile and his first half performance. Stuart, your thoughts? Staff display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. So back underway here into the second half. An effective challenge. Verratti on to Jorginho. He's going forward well here. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Cleared away comprehensively. Breaking at pace. Can they keep it going? Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Well, those stats tell you what a good game this has been. We've seen a lot of good attacking play, plenty of goal mouth action, and all done at a high tempo. It's been very entertaining so far. And not a great challenge, free kick here. Immobile. Can he do it to take the lead? Oh, keeper dealt with it. And he did what he had to do defensively. And the outcome is a free kick here. Gabby. Just the challenge that was required. He has teammates around him. Pellegrini. A bit wasteful from Italy. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Well, it fizzled out. Pellegrini Giacomo Raspadori and he's broken free oh he's gone for goal he got a good palm on it <laughs> foul there free kick awarded <laughs> so a personnel change then Rodri well, doesn't have to do it on his own and with that the attack fizzles out can they hit on the break now we're inside the final 15 minutes Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Playing it in. Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. It's one corner after another. Can someone get on the end of this? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Rodri. Shot attempted. Body in the way.
Marco Verratti went in strongly to win the ball still to go and the teams cannot be separated and with that the attack fizzles out well it's been a frustrating day for these fans they want a goal they're urging them to attack now and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack Asensio Immobile now Raspadori shielding the ball superbly there we have it the 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides back underway here and it's quite simple both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes very quick thinking there being pressed here Marco Asensio on the ball Bastoni Jorginho Velocity in the right place to cut out the pass now options are plenty Velocity must take the lead here and the ball is loose and there it is, a goal I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper Well, here it is again, and the striker does everything right. He hits it across the goalkeeper, which makes it difficult for him. And then the player coming in is alert for the rebound. What a good goal that is. The ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Opportunity in the wide area. Marco Asensio waiting to pounce. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. This could square the game. And foiled by the post. And a time for cool heads. Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. And away they go again. Second period of extra time has commenced. Sarabia firing it towards goal and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it the short corner and Morata's in the vicinity well they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity can they fashion something they need a goal Morata oh keeper dealt with it time is not on the side 
This corner could help their prospects as they look for an equaliser. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And he's fired over the corner. Velocity. Getting in there to intercept. Well, still time for them to level it. Sarabia. Now Morata. There will be one minute added on at the end. And intercepts again. The final whistle, and it's gone horribly wrong for Spain in terms of the scoreline. Stuart, your analysis. Well, a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed.